So today we're going to focus on the street smart wealth plan. And this plan is going to lay things out for you in a way that you can understand and you can start to plug yourself into the formula for success. So let's talk about the wealth plan and what is the wealth plan? Well, many of you that have been following me know that I believe find the buyer before you even buy the real estate. And I learned that from the last downturn, the big downturn, right? The big crash that left me holding the bag on about a dozen properties that we had bought right, bought cheap. The formula was working beautifully on the flipping side of things. And all of a sudden they shut out the lights. They pulled the chairs out from under. They put us in a position where I didn't have any customers. Well, I had plenty of customers, but the banks were not approving loans. The banks pulled the rug out from under the financing. So what's the opportunity? Well, it did present itself and that was to find the buyer before you even buy. So turn on the house monster is the first step. And that's what I call go. That's the beginning point. And then what you want to do is buy a property for that customer. So what we're going to do is buy right and buy cheap. Now, if you're like me, you like a bargain. You like a really good deal. Well, how do we get bargains? We find deals no one else knows about. And that's one of the things that I focus on in our buying strategy is finding those deals that we're not in competition with everyone else. Now, next is to create income to get out of the job. So if you're like a lot of people, you're still working for someone else. You're still living maybe paycheck to paycheck. You're still trying to find a solution, find an out, find an exit. And what I've discovered is if you can build a foundation of income to replace the income you've already got, then you've got an amazing opportunity to be able to exit working for someone else and start working for yourself. All right. The next thing is to use tax benefits, use tax benefits as a profit center. And one of the great things about real estate is it gives you the opportunity to actually get what's called depreciation write-offs. And I've covered that in other videos where I talk about the wonderful magic of depreciation and how you can literally be put in a position to zero out your taxes. So let's just call it legally reduce your taxes forever. Legally reduce your taxes forever. And that's by using tax benefits that exist in the tax code. But you got to understand what those benefits are and how you can apply them in your own world. Now, the next is to be the bank. I love the fact that our business is actually a financing business where we're able to take real estate and give people an opportunity they otherwise wouldn't have. And the way we're able to do that is to give them the chance to buy the property that they're moving into. And we give them a long-term strategy of being able to build up their credit, build up their down payment until they can either go to the bank and qualify for a loan or be able to get their financing from us. And it works out beautifully. So that's the be the bank concept where, that creates retirement accelerators for you. And what that means is once you build that dependable, predictable monthly income, man, you can have an amazing life. You can have an amazing retirement. You don't have to worry about social security. You don't have to worry about whether it's going to be there for you or not. You don't have to worry about a pension. You don't have to worry about a company that might shut down sometime sooner or later, technologies change. All of a sudden a company gets absorbed or it goes bankrupt. They bankrupt out the pension plans or they simply don't pay out the pension plans. There's a lot of municipalities right now that promise pensions to people 
that never paid those pensions or stopped paying those pensions. So it's something we don't have to worry about what, when we have our own assets that we're earning income on, on a monthly basis. I love the residual income aspect of our business. That's one of the things I absolutely teach you is cash now, cash flow and cash forever. So you can do that when you actually convert from flipping fast to flipping slow. And the flipping slow model is to have the ability to receive income when the people move in and also on a monthly basis ongoingly while they're living there and then moving up on your path to home ownership where they're increasing, increasing, increasing the amounts that they're paying you so that they can move up the ability to actually get financing from you. It's a marvelous, incredible, amazing way that you can, it, you can really set your own investments up. You don't have to worry about wall street. You don't have to worry about crypto and whether it's going to come, whether it's going to go, we don't have to worry about that with our properties because we've already got a customer living there. And once they move up to the owner finance or in-house financing level, then they take on all the maintenance on the property. So a hundred percent of the maintenance, a roof, water heater, just like at your house, you have to take that responsibility because you're owning or buying that home. Well, the same thing happens with our in-house financing program where the customer that's living there is actually taking on the responsibility to take care of those things. All right. Now the next concept is to pay down, pay down and pay off those mortgages. Get yourself in the world of free and clear, because that's the safest place you could possibly be in your business. And I love to teach people how to do that. You will get freedom sooner because of that. Now, the next aspect is to work with the customer that you've already got to provide additional services to them, additional benefits to them. And that can create what's called additional income for you. Now, what that is, is what we call profit centers. And where a typical landlord is, is the difference between what they owe on the mortgage plus taxes and insurance and what they rent it out for. That difference is their profit. Well, we begin there and add 25 more profit centers above that, many of which are services for our clients or incentives for our clients to pay timely and do the right thing according to the contract that they signed. So the profit centers that we have built in accelerate your cash flows, therefore creating, thereby creating income to get out of the job even sooner. It's a powerful concept where you are able to take the properties that you currently own and convert them into much more profitable properties where you're literally using the same customers that you have in the properties, the same properties, you're just offering a different program to the customers you already have. And as a result of that, you can increase your cash flow dramatically and you can increase your monthly income dramatically with the same customer in the same property. Now, also using the concept that I started out with finding a customer, now we offer and find a property for them. And again, you can enjoy all these additional benefits and profits as a result of how you are structuring your business. I said that business is a formula. That's exactly what I want you to know that we have a formula for success. And in fact, the final part of the wealth plan is to protect assets by avoiding lawsuits protect assets by avoiding lawsuits. And the way you avoid lawsuits is to not look like a fat, juicy, ripe tomato ready for the picking. No, you want to have privacy. You want to have protection. You want to have probate avoidance and you want to have profits. The four P's of a wonderful thing I discovered called trusts land trusts and personal property trusts. Those are the best place to get started in terms of protecting what you've got 
because there's so many benefits. Like I said, privacy, for example, not having your name on public record, the ability to separate and segregate your assets from one another so that there's not going to be a problem. If there were a problem with one asset, it would not infect or affect or contaminate all the other assets that you've got. So you've got an opportunity to do that when you learn about that amazing concept called trusts and in the center is study, learn, systemize and improve. And so as we work together, one of the things I want to do is teach this to you step by step. 